so this video is extra late this month. Hey vapers, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my monthly unboxing and tasting of my sample box. <laughs> Alright guys, yes, today we are looking at my monthly sample box. This is June's box. As you can see, I have not opened it. So let's just dive right in. Oh, this package always smells so good. Oh my gosh. This sample box is a lot heavier than my past boxes. And let me show you why. This awesome new feature available at samplebox.com. So we'll open it up. Got my flavor menu, a couple stickers, and the best of box card. Here we go. OMG, they're huge. These are 30 mil bottles. So for $3 a bottle, you can upgrade individual bottles in your box to 30 mils. And I actually got to pick out all of these flavors. I don't really remember which ones I picked out and I know I did pick a few that I've had before. This is Crew Juice Blue Cocoa. It is a blueberry coconut vape and it's so good. It's by uh, Lou at East Coast Reviews and it's one of my favorite flavors of all time. I'll go ahead and show this one up close since it's been a while and there's probably a bunch of new people here who have never heard of it. And this is a $20 bottle for 30 mils. 70% VG made in Farmingdale, New York. So let's just go through the box and then I will try a few of these. Next up I have Hard Time by The Get Down, which I love that series on Netflix. That's why I picked this one probably. And this is, oh my gosh, there is no flavor description for this one. In my flavor menu thingy, I don't know if you guys can see it, but like it's not there and I'm not sure why I picked this one either, probably because of the name. We'll find out. It is $22 for a 30 mil, 70% VG made in Santa Ana, California. Next I have Black Label's Eskimo Kiss, and this is Minty Menthol. You know what, I think when I picked these, I don't think there's, no, there's not a flavor profile, it's just like the name and the brand, and so I probably picked this one, Eskimo Kiss, because it sounded cute, but it's a minty menthol, my bad. This is a 50% VGE liquid, $23 for a 30 mil made in Torrance, California. Next, I have Gone, and I've tried this before, and I picked this one because I like it. It is Cookies and Butterscotch, and this is from Atlas Vapor. It is $17 for a 30 mil. Max VG made in Woodstock, Georgia. Next I have Stay Classy Afternoon Delight. This is raspberry lemonade and iced tea. It's $20 for a 30 mil, 70% VG made in Farmingdale, New York. And the last bottle on my first layer is Burn. This is the flavor two, or it's B-V-R-N, but I'm guessing the V is supposed to be a U. And this is a gummy watermelon flavor. This is $20 for a 30 mil, 70% VG, made in Costa Mesa, California. All right, so that was my complete first layer. Let's take a look at the, ooh, the second layer looks lit. Especially these three bottles. Okay, let's go through it. Ooh, past Tia did a good job because me right now, I don't remember picking these. But this one, Cine Swirl by Cali Steam. Obviously, this is gonna be a cinnamon roll. Yeah, sweet cinnamon bun with creamy icing. It is $16 for a 30 mil, 70% VG, made in Los Angeles, California. Next up I have Cali Milk by Cali Steam, and this obviously looks like strawberry and milk, yes. Again, $16 for a 30 mil, 70% VG, made in Los Angeles, California. Next up I have Panda Shake by Milkshake Liquids, I think, and yes, it's called Milkshake Liquids. This is chocolate vanilla milkshake, so I think it's a cookies and cream. You can see like the Oreo cookies on it. It is $20 for a 30 mil, 70% VG, made in City of Industry, California. City of Industry, California, that's really weird. Is that actually a place or is this a typo? Next I have Breezy Shake by Milkshake E-Liquids, and this is a strawberry and vanilla milkshake. Again, $20 for a 30 mil, 70% VG, made in City of Industry, California. Maybe that's not a typo because it says that one for that one too. 
Oh, <laughs> wow, I'm, I, I don't think these ones had pictures because I would have been like, oh, they're all from the same brand. This is apple shake and this is apple pie milkshake. $20 for 30 mil, 70% VG, made in City of Industry, California. That's just so weird. All right, so these two flavors of the box I've already tried, so I'm not going to try here today. Check out my past sample box videos if you want to check those out. And then this Black Label Eskimo Kiss because it is a menthol and that was my bad. I picked that one and... <laughs> Maybe I should have looked it up first. And so since I have three flavors from the same e-liquid line, I'm going to pick one to try. And I'm going to pick the apple pie milkshake one because I've had lots of strawberry milkshakes. I've had lots of cookies and cream milkshakes. So I want to try this one. And I have two from Cali Steam. And I'm going to try the Cine Swirl because I've had a million strawberry milk flavors. And I've had a million cinnamon flavors, cinnamon bun flavors too. But I like this. Like this, I'm craving this right now. I'm also going to try the Get Down hard time because I have no idea what it is <laughs> unless I smell it and I don't like it <laughs> maybe I'll still try it but who knows not if it smells like anise or anise that spice that's like black licorice and I'm also going to try afternoon delight by stay classy because it is a raspberry lemonade iced tea flavor and I need some refreshing drink vapes for the summertime okay first up is apple shake by milkshake e-liquid oh my god it smells so good that was like Ooh, I am trying them on my Troll RDA. I always use my Troll RDA and I feel like I've said it enough that I maybe I shouldn't say that whole little spiel again. I don't even know if people actually use those little 5 dripping atomizers that I'm always like talking about because like they used to, like I used to use them all the time. I probably used them for a couple years, like two, at least two, maybe three. And then I figured out how to put a coil in my RDA. But does anyone out there actually use those? Like they helped me. I'm wondering if they're helping other people. Let's try this. This smells so good. I haven't smelled an e-liquid that good in a long time. Okay. Mmm. This is really good. It basically just tastes like a really heavy apple pie and ice cream. Like if you had a scoop of ice cream with the apple pie a la mode. Kind of tastes like that kind of flavor. But like lots of ice cream, lots of apple pie. I guess an apple pie milkshake would taste like exactly the same anyway. But like I think of more of like a lot of apple pie with ice cream on top versus like equal parts. Or more ice cream versus less apple pie. There's definitely more apple pie. Mmm. Oh my goodness, I I really, really like this flavor. It's just like, it's kind of like a, like an evening time or colder weather type vape. It's like really hot outside right now, so I'm like, oh, this is kind of like heavy and sugary. Definitely a great dessert vape though. Probably going on my favorites list, not gonna lie. Next, I'm going to try Cali Steam's Cineswirl. Now, I've tried a lot of flavors from Cali Steam, and I haven't really fallen in love with any of their flavors or been like overly impressed or anything. Mm, oh my gosh, it smells like a flaky light cinnamon roll, but I am willing to give it another chance because cinnamon swirl mm. <laughs> So this is probably like one of the better Cali steam flavors that I've had so insert foot into mouth Because I could definitely vape this for a cinnamon roll flavor. It's actually freaking delicious and I have my favorite cinnamon roll, but I also have like two runner-ups and you know what this would pop right up there It's just a fantastic yummy flavor I almost feel like cinnamon is one of my top favorite dessert flavors now where it used to be very bottom Super cinnamon sugary has a lot of icing on it. It's really yummy and flaky It's not like a heavy doughy cinnamon roll. It's a light flakier one, but it is a freaking delicious Mm. Gives me high hopes for the Cali Milk Strawberry Milk flavor by them. Now I'm going to try the Afternoon Delight by Stay Classy. Mm. I just don't like the way raspberry smells. I've never liked the way raspberry... Oh my god, I have like slime on my hands. I was uh, making new slime earlier today. A new slime video coming this weekend. Yay! Uh, <laughs> Sidetrack. Yeah, I don't like the smell, but the vape will taste much better. Hopefully it does. Hmm. Well, it's interesting. So I've had tea flavors and I've had lemonade flavors. I don't think I've ever had like the two combined. So it's kind of weird because tea is kind of like a, how do I describe it? Tea is like mellow, subtle, like earthy sweet and lemonade's really tart and sugary and just, you know, like it's 
So to mix those two together, it's a weird combination and it's definitely raspberry on the inhale, raspberry lemonade, and then as you're exhaling, you get that tea vibe, the iced tea vibe. It's weird. I think it could grow on me. And last today, I am trying Hard Time by the Get Down. Maybe. We're gonna smell it first. <laughs> what? I don't know. It smells like plants and it smells like Coca-Cola. And there's no way I could tell you what it is by what it smells like. Um, I need to look that up, but I actually don't even have my phone on me. It's out in the other room charging. I don't know. It smells weird. It tastes weird. I guess I'm gonna go find out what it is. It's watermelon lemonade with strawberry. What? No. So that was my June sample box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you got in your box or if you got any of these flavors or if you love any of these flavors. I definitely loved the flavors I tried except for the Get Down. That one was like, what? Super awesome that now if you like an e-liquid, you can pick it and upgrade your bottle. And let me just tell you guys, with the 30 mils, that box is a $215 value with all the 11 30 mils in it, but it was, it's $50 base rate, but $3 for every bottle, so 33, so it was like 85, we'll round up, $85 for that whole box and with, at a $215 value, so that's incredible. Someone's calling me, I bet it's my mom, but my phone is, oh, it's not my mom, it's my stepdad. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I will leave a link below to where you can check out Zample Box for yourself if you're interested in checking them out. Subscribe to this channel for more videos. Check the description box below for important links like where to get my favorite things like e-liquids, mods, etc. You can follow me on almost any social media site like Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or Snapchat. All those social media links will be below. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please join Casa.org and learn how you can fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia and thank you so much for watching.